Uh, so let's talk about my calendar one and then the idea is you don't want to have a intersection between two interval so one of the condition um, I mean the easy way to do is using the tree map right you want to use a lower key lower key this function in the tree map and if you compare the ending with the starting if the if the lower key at ending is actually less than the starting for the value you implement you can actually return true and put into the map right if not you're going to return false so tree map key is going to be integer value is going to be integer initialize the tree map right, integer dot you know low equal to map dot lower key the ending so you can actually traverse the tree map to get the lower key so if no is equal to no so which means there's no value you know um, there's no value inside the map or there's no value for lower key and the end you can actually you know put the value into the map and you can choose else you want to find does my current does my current ending is less than equal to start if this is true you want to return true and if not you want to return false what am i typing all right so this will be it. so space is all of n time this is time so it's going to be log n you will split you know half of them every iteration to find out what is the lower key for this guy Alright, this is the beneficial for the for tree map. So if you are still not going to, you know, not familiar with the tree map, you can use the list and basically just traverse the list. So books, if you new array list, and then for in book, books. So you want to return, uh, sorry, you want to return two right here. And then before you return, you want to add interval into it, into the books. So you want to return false. Return false if let's just do this. So 10 and 20, 15, 15 and 25. So you want to get a maximum for the starting time. So 10 and 15, you end up 15, and minimum for the ending time 20 and 25 so this is 20 if your starting time is less than the ending time the, if this condition is true you want to return false because there is overlapping if you don't believe it let's look at another interval so 10 and 20 20 and 30 10 and 20 so this 10 represent this one this 20 represent this guy so ending 20 and 30 so maximum for the starting is 20 minimum for ending is 20 does 20 less than 20 no so you don't return post so if math math or max books at zero comma star if this is less than max dot min and or oh, actually i can do a pattern you want to return false Okay, so time and space are the same, all of them for the space, and in time you traverse every single book in the array. So this will be it. So if you have a question, leave a comment, and I will see you later. Bye.